What is up guys and welcome back to the vlog. So I actually have a free room for like four nights at the plaza. This is a casino Jordan ended up getting robbed at, but he also has a room here as well. So I do need to go check in so that way I can get comped. As I said in yesterday's vlog, I'm gonna be getting like free money to gamble with pretty much. So I need to get that done as soon as possible. I was supposed to check in at 11. Right now we're going on 1.30 almost. I just got all checked into the hotel and I actually FaceTimed Jordan and of course he was naked getting in the shower. But today, I guess it's okay because I didn't even tell him that I was coming down or anything. I just came over here and checked in. So I'm all ready to go. I think I'm gonna head up and just see what the hotel room's like because I've never stayed here. I don't even know if I'm gonna be staying in the hotel room. But in order to get comps, you do need to be checked in. So I'm gonna head up and check out the room really quick. So this is what the hotel room looks like. I mean, it's not really anything special, but it is free, so I think that's pretty cool. <laughs> Got a nice view of some parking lots. Couple casinos down there. Yeah, definitely have a shitty view, but hey, it was free. So I really can't complain too much, and not only that, but I don't even know if I'm gonna be staying here. Maybe Rachel and I will come up here one night and just hang out and just get away from the house, like a little vacation at home, away from home. I think that'd be pretty cool, just come hang out, you know, grab some dinner, come up, chill in the hotel room, maybe watch a movie or something, and just relax. Finally hanging out with my dad, again, for the third day in a row. What are we doing? Um, I'll go eat. I'm kind of hungry, yeah. Yeah, okay, let's get some food. All right, sounds good. actually got some dining credit. I think we're gonna head over to what, Subway and grab some food. Jordan thinks he's getting Subway, but in reality, he's actually probably getting my $5 inch long. <laughs> no foot logs over here. Not only is Jordan staying at the casino, he ended up getting robbed at. Jordan, show him. He's, he's wearing the same exact boxers the day that he got robbed. We just got done eating our Subway, and right now, Jordan and I have an errand to run. I'm not gonna tell you guys what it is just yet, nor am I gonna show you. So I want you guys to guess to figure out what Jordan and I are doing. So I already know you guys are probably thinking, wow, Cody, this vlog is short as hell. Now let me tell you, Jordan and I have not even gambled once today. We went to the post office and the post office we went to, we weren't able to do what we needed to do. So we actually had to come back to my house, fill out a ton of paperwork online that took a couple of hours. And I'm gonna be getting my passport, hopefully within a week. Uh, I paid a shit ton of money to have it expedited and everything. Who knows, maybe next week I'll end up going to the Bahamas. I guess you guys are just gonna have to wait and see. So next stop of the day is El Cortez, and now the reason we're here is Jordan is actually registering for a blackjack tournament. And unfortunately, I'm not gonna be able to play with my dad this time because I haven't really played here that much, but Jordan had a room here for four days and he played a little bit, so he got into this blackjack tournament. It looks like they're having some like uh, bull riding competition at the plaza tonight. Me and Jordan, I think, are gonna be doing this tomorrow since we couldn't sign up on time today. Jordan actually just asked our casino host if he could ride the bull. So, uh, I think that's what he's gonna do. Yeah. This is our host, Nathan. Jordan's gonna... Uh, no, not me. He's going, though. He's gonna sign a waiver and, uh... Oh, yeah, it's going on YouTube, for sure. No, that's the back. That's the rope you hang on to. There you go. Nathan's over here watching too. All right, let's go, Jordan. I hope he falls in each shit. <laughs> you better crank that up a little bit quicker. He's probably getting aroused right now. Jordan, you better grab onto that rope a little tighter. <laughs> yeah, you lasted about a good 30 seconds, I think. Alrighty, guys, so that is gonna wrap it up for this vlog. I know this vlog was extremely short, but guess what? The casino vlogs are done. No more casino for Cody. And I have a couple of things I wanna show you guys and a couple of things that I wanna tell you. So one of you, one of you guys, 
thought it would be funny to tell Jordan to do this on me and I actually freaked out yesterday but I didn't grab my camera because I was just so angry at the time. Jordan sent me this picture and he said sorry dad and this picture, see if it will uh, focus. As you guys can see, it looks like my rear windshield is cracked. And I was like freaking out. I'm like, Jordan, what the fuck did you do to my windshield, bro? I was so pissed. And he was like, I'm just kidding, man. It's just an app. He was like, one of your fans actually told me to do this to you. So you guys got me. I really honestly thought my windshield was cracked because that app makes it look extremely realistic, especially since I kind of parked like an asshole. I parked like halfway in my yard, halfway in my driveway. So I just was assuming that maybe something fell from the huge palm tree that's like right in my front yard. Or I don't even know, but I honestly thought that my rear windshield was smashed. And another thing that I want to tell you guys, I know Devin and I have been putting this off for a long time, but I promise 150% in tomorrow's vlog, you guys will be able to find out what our secret or news or whatever you want to call it is. But that is going to wrap it up for this vlog. Once again, I apologize that it was short, but just know that the casino vlogs are over. A extremely long vlog is coming for you guys this Sunday so that way you guys will be able to relax on your Sunday and watch a nice long vlog. Shout out of the day is actually going to go out to Thomas Burman on Twitter. Thank you so much, Thomas, for following me. And not only that, but always retweeting all of my tweets. And I know damn well you have my post notifications turned on because as soon as I tweeted today, who wants to be shout out of the day? Within a millisecond, he was the first person to retweet the tweet, so that is why he's getting shout out of the day today. If you guys would like to be shout out of the day, make sure to follow me on all my social media accounts. Links are always in the description below and be active. Like my tweets, retweet my tweets, like my pictures on Instagram, and that can always better your chances at being shout out of the day. And I will see you guys tomorrow.